Hi, welcome to TechRanch, a place where we learn and earn technical skills in the most efficient way. Let's make coding fun. Practice project ideas. Barcode generator. Barcode 128 Sky Character Generator is a most useful feature in commercial application where it is uniquely identifying individual product and feed it in the database with the complete description like price, quantity, status and many more in category in an inventory management system where all the supermarket, grocery store or any kind of commercial use. Objective of random bar code 128 generator is in defined in five steps. Step 1, we first generate the random numbers of code 128 sky characters. Step 2, create an image of barcode out of that random numbers. And number 3, create a read-only PDF file. Number 4 step, write randomly generated barcode in PDF which is in read-only for the safety reason. And number five, the most important, we have to include and import Java API jar libraries in the application. As for the design, step one, we have to first create the random number generator class. Step two, we create the barcode image. Step three, we create the read-only PDF file where we are going to write that image in the step four. And in the last, we include and import the Java API jar libraries. Now let's take a look at the development. This is my application barcode demo. For first step, we have to first create a random number. We are going to call the thread local random and current and next int and create the string or the number of digits of specific number and make it in an integer form. Step two, we create the image of barcode associated with that step two we create the image for the bar particular barcode with the help of a pdf writer and itext.jar file we'll see that in the step five in step three we create the pdf file in a specific local system path and step four we create the we set the barcode associated to the random number we created in the step one and write it down in the PDF. In step five, we include the jar file, itext.jar file, which is available. You can download it over the net. Now, barcode generated demonstration, you can see this will be the output of the of the application. It is a simple barcode 128 sky character generated. This is the most useful feature in commercial application to uniquely identify individual product and feed it in the database with description in inventory management system. Now let's take a look at the execution. So this is my Eclipse IDE and here I have created barcode demo application. This is a simple Java project. Here I have created a package and barcode generated demo and the random number. So step one is creating random number. Now here you can see I have simply included my Java util part package. So random number Java will create your random number and this method will return the string of random number. Now in barcode step 2, we'll see the barcode generator demo class. In this class, we have PDF writer. This is the API. We are going to use it and include it in this in iText PDF. You can see so this will help to create the PDF in a specific path in your local system and this will be the path of your system where it is going to be write the PDF and next step we have to set the code so 128 is the barcode 128 class object now this is included in your itext.jar file if you can see here in your library when you add you can find out these type of classes I have included my decompiler plugin in my Eclipse so I can see the class file but I it is in a read only mode so you cannot edit it it's just for reading so this is the class where I have created an object and uh, it is from the API 
I text for PDF writing and PAR code 128 generated. Now here after this, I'm associating my random number with this PAR code and setting the code into the image, step four. Now step five, including the API. Now, all you need to do download the itext.jar file from the net and once it is in a local system all you need to right click on the project and go to the properties and build a path and here you can add like this now once it is done then you are ready to execute right click run as java application now this is the execution of barcode sky 2028 generated by techcrunch now this code you can use it in your product identification now if i execute this once again it will generate another it will create another pdf file and this so this is another randomly generated barcode So every time when I execute this application, it will create another generated code which is random. And this particular barcode you can assign to individual product and feed the data in the database, product name, product description, price, quantity, status, out of stock, in stock. So we have seen the demonstration of barcode generator. Next session, we are going to provide the barcode reader implementation. So stay tuned. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel and stay tuned. And don't forget to press the bell icon to get the notification. Let's make coding fun. Thank you.